All right, problem one. We always want to get all our variables together on one side, all our numbers on the other. Well, luckily, here's our equal sign. We have just the number 24 to the right of the equal sign. 2x plus 4x, well, that's 6x. Now, we need to get x by itself, so we need to undo this multiplying by 6. So we're going to divide by 6, divide by 6, and we get x is 4. That means if you change this x value to a 4, 2 times 4 plus 4 times 4 equals the number 24. Now we're trying to figure out what x would be here to make it true. There's two ways you could do this. The most common way is what we will do. We'll go ahead and distribute the 3 through. Usually when you see parentheses, that's the first thing that goes on in your mind. 3 times 2x is 6x. 3 times 1 is 3. That equals 15. Now we need to move our number to the other side. So let's add 3 to both sides of the equation. 6x on the left equals the number 18 on the right. So we've gotten all numbers on the right-hand side. We have all variable pieces to the left. How do we undo multiplying by 6? Well, just like last time, we're going to divide by 6. And we get x is equal to 3.